Okay, so we are going to practice everything that we have been going over so far. Your page will look like this. You need your counters. We are going to place the counters in the five frame to show the number three. Listen carefully. Find your counters or things around you if you can't find your counters to show the number three. So that means we need one, two, three items. And you are going to put them on the five frame. One, two, three, okay? And you could color it in. One, two, three. Next, you are going to count and tell how many, okay? So you are going to count one, two, and you are going to write the number two. Next, you're going to count how many. I'm not gonna count them for you. I want you to do it yourself because this is a test prep. Because I'm gonna, going to call you guys individually and at your individual time, I'm gonna give you guys a test. So you're gonna count them and then write the correct number on the lines. How many books do you see? Do you see one book? two books, three books, or four books. You are going to fill in the circle underneath the correct number. So that means you're going to color in the circle underneath the correct number. Next, we're gonna look at the next page. And we are going to count how many oranges. Let's count. One, two, three, four, five. We need to show that there are five oranges by using our five frame. See, one, two, three, four, five. So we need to color in one cube for each of our oranges because we said there's five oranges and there's five cubes so here's an example mrs mcneil will show you look at this here's one we dragged it down and then you would color it you would put that one there right if you could bring these down that would go to the third box this would go to the fourth box, and this would go to the fifth box. That's why you would color them in, because you have a box for each one of the oranges. You do not have to draw the lines, I'm just showing you. But you do have to color in each box to represent an orange, okay? And you are going to turn the page. Now we see the number five. Everybody say five. You're going to trace it. Go down, loop around, come back up, and go across. That's number five. Let's count how many lemons. One, two, three, four, five. Let's show that we would be dragging each lemon down to one of the cubes. We bring that one down there. Two, three, oops, four, five. So each one would have a lemon in it. So color in all five cubes. We're not writing the number five, we're coloring in each one. We'll do the next one together. Okay, again, the number five. We're gonna trace it. And we're gonna count them. One, two, three, 
four, five. And we're gonna put them into a cube. So you would drag it down. One, two, three. See how they all go into a different cube? Four, five. See how they all went to a different cube and all of them went down? So then you're gonna color them all in. We're not writing the numbers five, we're coloring them in. Okay, now we're gonna go to this page. You need to listen to the directions carefully. I will record it and then I will also stop it and say. So on number three, you need to place a counter to show five. So this is why you need your counters, okay? So you'd put one counters, two counters, three counters, four counters, five counters. See, there's one, two, three, four, five. Then you are going to take them off, color all five in, to show that there are four, five counters, and then you're going to write the number five on the line. Look at number four. You are going to place counters to show four. Take your counters, I'm not gonna show you, Put four counters down in the four spots. Write the number four. Go ahead, I'm gonna give you time to do that. Okay, number five. Place counters to show five. So on this one, you need to put five counters on the five frame, okay? It's called a five frame because there's one, two, three, four, five boxes. So you need to put counters down in each box, count five, and write the number five. Okay, I'm gonna give you time to do that. Make sure you color in the boxes. Do not write the number in the boxes. Color the boxes, color the cubes. And then we're gonna look at number six. Listen carefully. Place counters to show three, okay? Three. So then you put your counters down, three counters down on your five frame, only three, color in three cubes, and then write the number three to show that you have three cubes. Great job. 